Right guys, welcome back to Heavy Rain. This is part three. It looks like we're moving on. Uh, we've just seen Ethan dealing with... Uh, first of all, we get introduced to Ethan. We see this kid get run over in part one. And in part two, we've seen him dealing with the tragic loss. Last time we seen him, he was out in the middle of the street with Nick Carr in the soaking rain. And now we're being introduced to this guy. So, And it looks like he's pulled up outside a motel. motel so dodgy what could he be possibly doing here just in case you're wondering guys this is a one player game and obviously there is two of us so we're splitting the um the characters the lead characters that you get to play as between the two of them so um i've done ethan and obviously the character that we're about to be introduced to now um is going to be controlled by my lovely, beautiful boyfriend. Yep, guys, you heard <laughs> it. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to be playing as this guy. And then, I don't know, there's another two characters, but we will decide who's going to be who when that comes to that time. So, um, Looks like we're looking for Lauren Winter. And the wee mad guy here in the office does not seem to uh, really... He's no help. Well, let's see if we can um, change his mind with a nice $5 bill. Looks like we can. Well, that guy was pretty cheap, I mean... Hi. <laughs> Third floor. Although, why would, um, like, why? I mean, it's, I don't know if you anything after that. You could easily. I Take suppose, the fiver and just be like, no, I'm sorry. If you don't want me to call the police, away you go. Yeah, I suppose you could always ask her back. <laughs> would you open, was, would you open the door to that man? I think it was the last door on the left. Oh shit, I fucking just knocked on. Is it the last door on the left? Okay. I think they said, they said last door. I don't know if it was left or right. It was the left. Sorry, I'll need to find my appointment. Clients? Oh no. Ooh. Sorry, we've got money. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Well, uh. <laughs> Fuck, she looks alright. I think she could get more than 50 bucks. I mean, <laughs> no, I'm just, I don't think she's selling herself a wee bit short mm. there. Like, money, money on the table. Yeah. Put the money on the table. Don't know how this works. No, fuck. <laughs> but we don't. Hey, fucking. And the controls, man, these controls. I know, do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> They're a little difficult to work sometimes. Is that a fifty dollar? What if he just gave her a five? He thinks that's all she's worth. Like. Mm. You should take your clothes off. We ain't gone all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. <laughs> not a customer. I should know. What you want? The freebie? Is that it? Is that shit illegal? Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. Mm. Families of the victims of the origami. Families of the victims of the origami asked me to. Just came to ask you some questions. So it looks like we're a PI. I already told the police all I know and have nothing. About Johnny, who the hell's Johnny? Right, so, right, so persist, convince, or compassionate? Uh, we'll go with the compassionate we'll option. Compassionate, yeah. I know what you're going through. Maybe we're just gonna think that we're being condescending. You know what it feels like to find your own son's body on a. Oh, oh. I think Johnny was our son. Oh, it's like that wasn't the way oh, to go. Fuck. Convince. Why would we just punch her in the face and demand answers? Like, just I mean. go convince. You didn't, oh, you fuck. didn't choose. <laughs> I thought I had unlimited time. Get out no. of here. <laughs> convince. Conf I'll go with persist. I that I got. <laughs> There'll be other victims if we don't stop the killer. Well, maybe that was the right way to go. You may know something, you may know something that can aid investigation. Help you, there's nothing you can do, my son is dead. My son's dead, do you hear me? He's dead. Hmm. Well if you can buy her. I said <laughs> Well she 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 normally sells, so I think we'll, we'll I bought ten minutes of your time today. All I ask is that you use that time to answer some questions. You want to pay me to tell you about my son, is that it? You can buy my body, Mr. Shelby, but my son is not for sale. You know, maybe that was the wrong answer. Yeah, I don't think you're going to get much out of her. No. Unfortunately. 
Mm. You're not making the best choices. Mm-mm. You're going to go for more money here. Maybe so. Well, if you remember anything, the oh, we're going to leave a card. Uh, no point in pushing her. She's not going to tell me anymore. Shouldn't I tell you anything? Didn't tell me jack shit. Investigation. Oh. oh, fucking investigation. Right? I didn't learn squat. Didn't learn squat. Well, that was my friend. <laughs> no. Have a wee poke around. Just make sure there's nothing. There's mm. nothing down there. Not but she like, really wants me to poke around her place. Like, uh, uh, I not very good at these choices, am I? Like, uh, getting us nowhere. Can't decide who's got the worst place. Right. Fucking her or Ethan. Just get out of there. We'll see what happens. Maybe she'll use the card later. Oh no. We're choking. All that information, we couldn't handle it. Fuck. It's in your pocket. But he's asthmatic. Yep. Oh no. Breathe. That guy's just walked past us. Not a fucking care in the world. Hmm. Hmm. Let's go save her. Even though she didn't give us any information, I think mm. we're going to save her. She will. We're going to do the decent thing here. What do you want, asshole? Lauren, is everything all right? Oh, she's on the floor. She's just swell. Now beat it, loser. Oh, but we're not having that. Crack the door down. No oh, fuck, I think I'm ready for a fight. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck, I'm used to the Xbox controllers, man. <laughs> uh. Oh, no. oh my god, he's right through the glass. <laughs> oh, I keep hitting it. Oh my god. I, I, I know what you mean, the X button's in the wrong place. Yeah, for fuck's sake. That's why you should only have one console, guys. Fuck me, when you get two, it just. All goes horribly wrong. It's a strength thing. Oh, fuck, I did it again, I was hitting the X. Now you were hitting square, you mean? Oh my god, I'm hitting them all the wrong ones. I can't tell if we're. Oh my god, just slammed through the table. Oh my god, he's got the glass. Can't mess up here. Fucking Lauren's not doing much help. Otherwise, you're dead. Oh, I didn't even. Oh, no. Don't get that glass out of his hands. I'd feel a bit more comfortable. Yes, break that arm. <laughs> Choking him out now. Just pounding away at the guy. Messed this her. This is such a long, drawn out fucking... fight. Oh, I keep fucking. Headbutt to the chair. What the hell? Oh my god. Yes. Combo. Oh, he's had enough. Uh, we're thoroughly. He has had enough. Done in. Gonna tell us anything? Sorry about the mess. Mr. Shelby. Yes. Yeah. Thanks. I'm just gonna give him a discount, half price. <laughs> <laughs> well, she still didn't tell us shite all. And there we go, limping away. Um, pretty fucking injured there. After that uh, beat down Press and. Me. Already, it looks like we're going to be introduced to another character, and we've just earned a trophy, a uh, white knight. If we want to have a quick look at what the trophy is. Oh, we're earning all these trophies on your account, so you're going to be the, the trophy queen. 
So we have trophies have we got? We've got White Knight, Sleazy Place, Beat to win it. Oh, Beat Troy, so we actually won. Yeah. That's 60.1%. Uh, good Father, that's rare. Uh, Only 29.6 points have that. That's pretty good. And then Interactive Drama, 78.71.8. So uh, not bad, three trophies and one of them was a rare. We're doing, we're doing all right. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, do you want to play this guy? Yeah. Yeah, sure, sure. Because I don't think it's Ethan. It looks very like Ethan. Yeah, Ethan, but not quite Ethan. <laughs> is that how we're going to refer to him as? Not quite mm. Ethan. The guy who has more than one son. <laughs> I believe the last character is a garden. Yeah. Okay. So I will play as this guy. You will play as the uh, last woman, and he is mm. getting out of his. He's a bit shaky on it. The hell! All these characters are messed up or something, man. I thought you were about to say meth addicts. <laughs> well, it could be that. He could I be I I from like the um, So we've got. Right, so we'll get out of the car here. We've got Mr. Ethan Myers, we've got Mr. Scott Shelby, and soon to be cop by the looks of it. Or a detective. Fuck. The controls are very, <laughs> very difficult in this game. I think you've got two good characters. From what I remember, the ground all shit all. Norman Jaden. Um, let me get some ID out, I think. It's like, this reminds me of going to Limelight. ID, please. FBI! Big shot. Well, it's fucking better let us pass me or I'll have your, have your badge in the morning. Yeah, but you ask, but you're supposed to ask them. Ask them what? They come up to say Blake, question mark. Oh, fuck. I lost them there. So, I'm guessing, since this is all cordoned off and we've got an emergency, we've got a, an ambulance there and that we're an FBI, this has got something to do with the old origami killer. I think it was. I think it was soon, right? Got some fancy ass glasses going on here. Oh my! This is like Terminator shit. Oh, we're recording it. Pretty cool. We've got the glove. Whose hand are we going to stick up? Whose ass here? <laughs> I'm assuming that tent is probably where the body is. Mm -hmm. To use R1 to use the. Oh, that's, that's, just, that's just loads of footprints. Oh, that's that's from everybody that's been trips and through here. Oh, there's some DNA over there. Pick it up. What have we got here? Harry Common, sample of no interest. Comes on Andrew Simpson. <sighs> He's a police officer. Stop leaving your shit. Stop fucking spoiling the crime scene. Yeah, do they not usually tend to not have these many this yeah, number of police officers yeah. walking? Well, I would go, go over to the body first of all, or what I'm assuming mm. there's a body. Okay, I'm going to try. Stop, that's going to take your glasses off if you do that. Okay, I'm trying to turn round. Ah! You hate you hold down R2 to me. I know, but I'm <laughs> fucking this up massively. Right, awesome. Here, if you press, oh my god. Like, press this to change the camera angle. Right. Totally missed this bit locking in. Right, what have we got here? The last bottle. Bank manager. Forced. No criminal Could be some drunk just. <laughs> some drunk bank manager. <laughs> What have we got here? Something mid Pollen? Uh, less than two. I don't think that's going to help as much. Um, I'm just leading towards the body. Mm, let's take a look at the body. Oh, fucking hell. It's 
go back. Hey, go the long way around. <laughs> I thought he was unsepping his pants there. I thought hey, he was taking. <laughs> what are you doing? Apparently, we're not allowed to let go. Even though we're FBI. I'm Agent Norman Jake from the FBI. I went by your office this morning. They told me you'd be here. Now, if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, can you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Okay, it looks like we're the we're the outsider, and they're not taking too kindly. No. Right, give us the facts. Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about six o'clock this morning. So find the much more right six o'clock. Based on what we've seen, based on what we've seen, it looks like the work of the origami killer. Cause of death. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. You don't have to follow him. You know. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. You can continue to like search the crime scene. Mm -hmm. There are no marks on the body. Chances are he was drowned, like the others. Witnesses? Any witnesses? Mm -hmm. <laughs> None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Has the time of death been established? Based on the rigor mortis? Must be less than six hours ago. We should know more once the coroner has had a look. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit stir and journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Do you have any leads? My men are going over to see with a fine tooth comb. The killer left anything behind. We'll find it. Listen, you look busy. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jade, come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. Hmm. Yeah. 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 Yeah, let's go and find some more Aaron clues. Column part oh. is disappearing in tall grass. It's probably the end of the trail. Put some DNA on the tracks. I don't know, this just seems really hard, this um, crime scene, Turner. Traces of blood on the railroad. Traces of blood? The blood report hmm. indicates an advanced and long lasting state of exhaustion. There's a footprint. Seems to stand out more than the others. Footprints continue just after the pollen. Mm. There's a good chance that they're the killers. So it looks like this pollen was important. Mm. For whatever reason. We could follow these footprints. I'm assuming they're going this way. Mm. No, they're not. We're stopping. Well, it's because mm. you, you need to. Do the thing again. Oh, really? Yeah, it only covers like a certain okay. amount. Oh, there's something there. Harry Conan. Traces of blood detected on the fence behind the railroad line. Oh my god, he slept. Looks like Jaden. Maybe all dirty. Oh, let's see if I can climb this. A slow pin. For me, only there four buttons here at the same time. <laughs> right. Did not press the thing before you. No. Hope I went up here. Hope there's something worthwhile up here. I'm sure there is. This seems to be wherever the killer went. Ooh. Oh man, get off your hands and knees. We're a complete mess. <laughs> get off your hands and knees. Mm, ah. Footprints. There's a 
good chance. Good chance out of the Kellers. Great. I wonder if we can find out the brand of the shoe and trace oh, them down. Got car tracks. Tire tracks. Tire tracks. Object memorized. That's a fancy gadget. Tell you what. And then it's all got washed away by the rain. I'd say. Oh no. And so did you. <laughs> oh. I'll <laughs> you do that. <laughs> oh, you yeah, asshole. Yeah. I don't think there's going to be anything else. Yeah, probably, yeah. Uh, he's got in his car and he's drove off. Yeah, I think um, we're, out, we're out of luck. Okay. Mm -hmm. he's, yeah. he's still got lots more of the um, crime scene that you could check, but I think that's probably going to be the majority of it. Um. Okay, let's try not to fall on our ass here as we're getting back down. I don't know, maybe that X button's going to trip you up again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh my god, no, I don't want to claim what the hell. And away back down you go. Right. <laughs> Alright, we're back safe on uh, level ground. Maybe a little dirty, but yeah, I'll try not get run you over know. by the oncoming train. Let's see if there's any other. I'm going to check these ones. Mm. Here. I think you're glitching out on the train tracks there. Yeah. Um, you never want to see if you can find something. You've not asked um, about the identity of the. Um, of who was killed? Hmm. I guess I can ask that. Uh, uh, oh. What's that? Oh, it's a cat. Oh no. The FBI doesn't keep files, <laughs> the FBI doesn't keep files on dead cats. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> God damn it. Poor thing. Hmm. Don't think you need to go any further down there. Um, we've got anything else? Tell you something, these police officers are just corrupt in this crime scene. Yep. They're doing shit all. Well, that guy's bending down, he might be. Oh, could we get getting some useful information for that? Oh. Mm -hmm. I believe we've seen this one either. Probably gonna be a police officer's ID or something. Colin Smith. Police um, officer. Oh, God damn it. Ah, again. That's just that's not good enough. Like they should not be. So there's people here that must be journalists. Right, I'm heading back, right, to, I'm back to the office. You staying? Not a lot. I think. Um. It's actually yeah. If you don't think that there's. Oh fuck! He's already made the it's because you do, you do, you don't have all the time in the world to decide, so you do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Um, there wasn't. You didn't look down the back whenever you were following him earlier, so I would say just do a quick wee sweep, make sure that there's nothing important anywhere really where you don't see footprints. You'll know that you've not highlighted. You know what I mean? Witness? No. Did they say there was a witness? Some guy walked this door. Oh yeah. Well, I don't think it was. It was more just that's what they found. Or oh, that's who found it. Mm-hmm. Can I have a cup? No happy days. Let's see if we can get some chat out of them. Murder. <laughs> There's been a murder. There's been a murder. Is that good? Mm -hmm. Good accent? That was a quick co coffee, mm. wasn't it? Down one. Let's ask about the murder. When did they find the body? Excuse me, but who are you exactly? These police Nothing officers did. are just so snarky. If you want to ask questions, you should speak to Lieutenant Blake, sir. 
If I already spoke to Lieutenant Blake. What a prick, don't like him. Yeah, of course. Do not like him. Right, away we go. Welcome. I think I'll take these glasses off and uh glasses. Take this uh Do you wanna go and get an actual look at the body and then we'll leave? Because I think he stopped you from doing it earlier. Oh yeah, good idea. Smart not just a pretty face? No, definitely not. Not even. Right, we'll get the I think we'll have we look at the body with the glasses on. <laughs> the glasses. Just to make sure we pick everything up. Mm-hmm. That weird pollen is doing my head in, like <laughs> coming right from the body. Right, let's have a look at this. Harry Connor, the victim is victim lying, lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. No visible signs of violence. There's a lot missed there. Yeah, thank God. Uh, superficial wound on the right side. Superficial wound on the right side. Blood is identical to that on the fence. Blood is identical to that on the fence. So he's probably cut himself. A small hourglass figure. figure in the right. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. The victim is Jeremy Bowles. Declared missing five days ago. Declared missing five file. days ago. An orchid was placed on the victim's orchid chest. Orchid was placed on the victim's chest. What did it fall on? His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. Not Deborah. Uh, must be familiar uh, with the rest of the, the bodies there. Eh? Mm. Similar okay. like circumstances. Okay. I think I've seen all there is to see. I think uh, it looks like we can finally leave. I mean, that would have been obviously a disaster if I'd left and not look at the body. I mean, <laughs> I probably say. the most important thing, you know. And, Almost left without it. Like, you know, what a shitty investigator I would be. <laughs> Good thing I'm here to keep you on track. Yep. Um, I think the ambulance is a wee bit too late. <laughs> yeah. Not gonna get much use out of that, don't think. I think I've had a change of guard there. Hmm. A female police officer now? We need a change of clothes. <laughs> yeah. Back into our car we go. We're going to get the seats on, buddy. <laughs> No seatbelt? How are you responsible? I know, is that still like a fine in it or penalty points or something? Mm -hmm. Maybe it's different if you're an FBI agent. Yeah, the same rules don't apply. Mm. Well, there we go, driving away through the crime scene. I think we actually picked up quite a lot of information there, whether it will be useful or not, I don't know, but mm. first day on the job is a. <laughs> Investigator, I think I did no bad. We've unlocked a new bonus. We have another trophy earned. Uh, this don't, is back to Ethan. Don't know what this is, guys, but we will uh, continue this in the next episode. And it looks like Ethan is. Think, Ethan. Give me the first Except you keep forgetting that these decisions have to be made within a time yeah, frame. Yeah, so fuck it, man. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Time frame. Uh, next episode, we'll, we'll see how Ethan is getting on. Until then, peace.